they stand and say, why he's singing? I'm waiting for somebody to get their breakthrough. That's what I'm waiting for. This ain't service like usual, okay? I'm waiting for you to get your breakthrough. Stop looking for the norm all the time. Look for God to do something great and miraculous. Look for God to do something mighty in your life today. I'm singing till somebody get their breakthrough. Waiting patiently. In line. He was there. That's it. I see some folk getting their breakthrough. I see it. I see some folk over there getting. Don't you li listen? Don't you worry about who watching you? Don't you worry about? I'm not gonna shut you up. Praise is always in order. Are you hearing what I'm saying? I, I preach long enough to know to let God have His way. See, we too busy trying to show off to let folk know what we can do. I already know I can preach. But it ain't about me. It's about God having his way. It's about people being healed and delivered. It's about people getting breakthrough. It ain't about no offering. It ain't about none of that. It's about you getting what you need. It's about you coming here and never leaving the same way you came. Somebody ought to look at somebody next to you and tell them God wants to change your life forever. Tell them for the better, for the better. And tell them today, today, not tomorrow. Tell him, not in three days, not in seven days. He wants to do it right now. I said he wants to do it now. Come on, see ya. If somebody told me that, I'd be screaming and jumping and running all over the place. Forever. He wants to change your life forever. He told the children of Israel, he said, look. Look behind you. This enemy you see today. <laughs> Are y'all hearing this? It's in Exodus. Am I talking right? He said, this enemy that you see today, you shall see them no more. You know what I love about this scripture? The word forever. Look at somebody and tell them what you're going through right now. You'll never go through it again forever. Now, 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 I'm not saying that you ain't going to go through nothing. I'm just saying what you're dealing with right now, you'll never go through this again. What are you saying? But I'm saying money will never be your problem again. I'm saying sickness will never be your problem again. And you know how long? Forever. Tell somebody forever. but he wants to do it. He wants to make change forever. He wants you to move out from where you are. Some of y'all need, and listen, I, I ain't trying to start no trouble, you know, but I'm prophesying and I know folk are receiving it, but there's about five people in here that need to move into a new home. I dare you to go praising God right now. I dare, I dare somebody to help them. Can I get some music so these folk that need some apartments can go to dancing? You need a new apartment, you need a new one. There's about five of you. I want to move out of that neighborhood. I'm tired of where I'm living. I'm tired of paying these people all this rent. I need right, I'm telling you, I'm going to call it out, but you better grab home to it. To get to it, but there's need in this house. And I speak to the spirit of grief. God gives us grief as a gift. Tears are just temporary relief. But when the grief becomes excessive, now we're going into strongholds spirit of heaviness but there is a remedy for the spirit of heaviness the bible calls it the garment of praise look at somebody say i'm ready to put my garment on now watch yourself 
Look, look at somebody in your row say, please excuse me. Tell, don't be scared. Don't be scared to talk to me. Look at the person next to you say, excuse me. Say, I have a question for you. I'd just like to know. Are you a praiser? Say, I really hope you are. Because I would really hate to have to shout all over you today. Y'all gonna help me praise God or what?